Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm looking a little rough. It's 8 o'clock at night and I'm coming at you with a grocery haul and then I might try to meal prep my lunches. I'm going to make wraps for work this week. I found a wrap that I love. Thank God it was at Walmart and they didn't have the good bread I like so... I went with what I thought sounded good at the time. Guys, let's get into this grocery haul. I got all of this from Walmart. Um, I was going to go to Aldi, but they don't really have a lot of stuff that like I want usually. So I usually just will go to Walmart or Cub Foods. It's like our local grocery store. Anywhere will work. And then I'm going to kind of tell you my ideas for food this week. So, or like for our meals this week. So let's get into it. Okay, so... <clears throat> I'm just going to go eat through each bag. I'm not going to have it in order or anything by any means. Um, but I just wanted to tell you I'm going to be using my crock pot again this week. Um, because last week I lost 5.2 pounds. Just getting back on track. Tracking everything. And using the crock pot. So first, first. First things first I want to show you. Um, chicken pot pie. In obviously like I said the crock pot. We're going to be having buffalo chicken in the crock pot, um, bourbon chicken, and the, and steak and fajita. I don't really know what to call it. It's going to be like a like a steak. I don't know. It's going to be really good. You guys will see it. Um, I'm probably going to make it for after this video. It'll be up. Um, <clears throat> my four night meal ideas for you guys. I'm going to try to make that kind of like a thing on my channel because I find it very helpful when I watch other people eat for like their dinners and stuff because that's where I struggle is dinner. I'm really good for breakfast and lunch but dinner comes and it's a struggle. I want to share with you guys what I got for these meals if you um, want to make them too. So anyways, <clears throat> I'm going to try out, this just looked good, Fire Roast Decor and this brand Del Monte is my favorite canned um, vegetable. I love it. So um, for the chicken pot pie I got diced potatoes um you could get real potatoes cut them up but i'm all about simplicity so we're just gonna go with it and then my favorite is the corn from del monte i could eat this right from the can cold it's so good um and then i got some more soy sauce because the recipes will need it i just got great value the low sodium yeah less sodium um oh yeah for the buffalo chicken i was gonna make it into a pasta so i'm gonna just um, when I get home, <laughs> when I get home, um, whew, I'll just heat up some water, boil some water, and throw these in a pan, and then just pour it with the buffalo chicken recipe and just stir it. You guys will see how I do that. For the wraps I was talking about, I'm having these for my lunch. They literally taste just like regular wraps. They're the carb counter. Um, they're 50 calories per per tortilla, tortilla, or they're um, one point each. So like. How could you not, you know? So exciting. Um, I just got this to have. It's not really for anything actually this week. Um, but I make buffalo shrimp. It was on my last video I actually just uploaded today actually. So it won't be the last one. But it'll be one of my like weekly night meals. I'll link it or it'll be in the description box. Um, I figured I'd give this a try with the shrimp this time. Next time I make it. Um, I got some honey for the steak recipe or the bourbon chicken, can't remember. Um, some light mayo for my wraps. For the chicken pot pie, I got some grands. Um, I just got the flaky layer original. I don't know how many points these are, but I'm just going to have one. So, like, essentially the filling of the pot pie is zero if you're on blue or purple. Um, the green, if you are on Weight Watcher Green, all of these meals that I have planned will actually be like obviously friendly for you you'll just have to track them and just kind of um you know track it on your app so that's all i can really recommend extra rice just to have not for a certain recipe um and then i got some dijon honey mustard um in case i want to have this instead of the mayo because sometimes i don't really want mayo essentially drinking some water oh you guys i think i hurt my back at the gym or something i don't know okay and then i got some fat-free cheddar for my wraps for lunch some fat-free cream cheese um and then for um 
for in case I want to have chicken salad instead of the wrap I give myself two options for lunch for work because I get really sick of eating the same thing so I bought two of these these are my favorite if you're an OG or if you've been here for a hot minute you know I used to eat this stuff all the time like it's so good it's like real chicken I just do this one's the 98% fat free literally they're the they're there's zero points, so so good, so freaking good, you guys. Um, this is the steak I got. I never buy steak, so I have no idea what I'm doing. Like, I was looking at all the steak, and I'm like, what the frick do I get? I need like to cut it up thin. I was looking for round steak. They didn't have any, so I just went with this flat iron one. It's pretty thin, and I'm just gonna cut it thinly, and then down the middle, and it should be enough just for Jay and I. So, super good. More minced garlic. I couldn't remember if I had any in the fridge, but it's like $2, so why not? I got some frozen chicken. Um, this is the chicken I ate all last week. I just get the three pound bag. It's like $5 and something. And to be honest, it's actually really good chicken. I Did you like the chicken, honey, that we had this week? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he likes it too, so. It's just the great value, boneless, skinless chicken breast pretty good it's like like i said you can get two bags for 10 bucks so it's a deal it's a deal spiel this hair is bothering me okay and then guys i got some skim milk it's called for um the chicken pot pie recipe i just got skim you can really get any kind of milk you want it doesn't really matter um peas love me some peas in my chicken pot pot and then just mixed vegetables that's going in there um for my lunch i got veggie dip light ranch um i really love this brand in the light dill or just dill it's so good but the ranch all they had was light at walmart i got some beef broth it called for beef stock but i just grabbed this one and i'm like you know what whatever for my wrap for lunch i got some shredded lettuce i got two bags because i figure once you open the bag they go really bad fast so this will be for like two days and this will be for two days factoring that in that one was the one with a hole um and then for my wrap i just got rotisserie chicken you can have four slices for one point and there's four servings so it'll make four wraps which four slices is actually plenty. Rock them all, but um, these, which I'm really grateful that this was the bag that had a hole in it because it would have sucked. But I just got these. I think they're like six points. I don't know. Let me scan them actually. Where's my phone? Let's scan these together. The future Brittany will know and could have just popped it on the screen. But anyway, so you just go on your thing and scan it. Five points, <laughs> underestimated. So yeah, they're 190 calories, so I'm just going to eat this with my lunch and my wrap. So I love rice aroni. It's so good. Um, my One of my faves. So I figured that would be good. And then for Mr. Jason, I got him his favorite bread and just turkey meat again. Same from last week if you watched last week's um, meal prep. Or I'm sorry, last week's grocery haul. And then for... Um, I feel like I keep saying for the chicken pot pie, but like everything's for it. I got celery and then also for my lunch, I'm going to have celery and dip. For the steak um, in the crock pot, I got red pepper, a green pepper, and an onion. I was going to get the pre-cut stuff that Walmart has, but it was $3. And I could have spent $3 and got way more. So I just went that route. And then I got a bag of baby carrots. So many bags, you guys, I know. I feel like very wasteful with all the plastic, but I had to do that because otherwise it um, gets water everywhere and it's everywhere. And then I got these for lunch, but I'm actually realizing I got the rice aroni, so I probably won't eat these, but they're a good snack. They're really good poppable chips. The barbecue and the sea salt are my favorite. And then I spent $5 on stupid ground ginger. But it calls for it in a recipe, and I love ground ginger, actually. I love ginger so much. So I'm like, you know what? I'll use it in another recipe, so it's worth it. <laughs> um, anyways, I'm actually 
not going to be meal prepping this week. Um, I'm kind of just going to, um, every night before work, throw my rice a in my lunchbox, throw um, two tablespoons of the light ranch and carrots in a box, and then um, I will put a wrap and some chicken, my cheese, my fat-free cheese, which is right here, and then whatever I'm feeling for sauce. So that could be honey mustard, this, um, and I also might have um, hot bluff or um, buffalo sauce or whatever, like Frank's Red Hot, that's always really good. So that's what I'm gonna have for um, lunches this week. Super exciting. Um, I'm really happy that I found the carb counter and they were actually not down the bread aisle at my Walmart. They were actually like out in the middle, down like by the meat. I don't know, it was super weird like where I found them. Oh my God, that looks good. Look at Buffalo Ranch wraps, that's what I wanted. Maybe I'll make that. Nah, it's 8.30 at night. But seriously, maybe I'll make that next week. That looks so good. And there's like ranch. Oh. Mm. Okay, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, like I said, it's Sunday. I had a really chill day. I hung out, edited a video, popped it up on YouTube here. Um, and then I just got ready, went to the gym, got groceries. And then Jason and I actually had... Um, jimmy john's so it was so so good i got a turkey tom without mayo and then i got a side of kick and ranch and it was only 12 points super good um and i have that with a sprite zero which i'm still drinking and yeah so anyways thank you guys so much for watching let me know if you like these kind of videos either by giving it a thumbs up or down below um yeah i love doing grocery hauls because i love watching other people's grocery hauls so that was fun. I will see you guys next week on the next meal prep grocery haul, whatchamacallit. Otherwise, I will see you in the next video. Stay tuned. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss my, my weekly night dinners to help you lose weight. I put these meals out there not only for you guys to lose weight, but actually for me too because I notice when I, um, when I post and I make videos and I share with you guys what I'm going to make, I feel like I have to do it to stay accountable. Um, not just to show you guys like because I don't have to post it, you know, like I choose to and it helps me lose weight And so I'm choosing to share it with you because it helps you lose weight and it's kind of like a win-win So you're helping me and I'm helping you so It works out both ways <laughs> um, I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching like I said and um, I will see you in the next video. Bye guys